Crab Bank Seabird Sanctuary is a small island just outside the mouth of Shem Creek in Charleston Harbor where seabirds um, and shorebirds have been able to go and nest, um, also rest, eat, uh, and do all the things that they need to do to be successful and raise their young since uh, 1950s when the island itself was built up from a sandbar using dredge spoil. Monitoring the nests at Crab Bank has been part of our routine until really till this year when there were no nests because the bank has uh, eroded to the extent that no birds can nest there. So seabirds populations have been in decline uh, worldwide by about 70 percent since the 1950s and part of that, a big part of that, is habitat loss and habitat disturbance. Uh, so we don't have a lot of places where the birds can go. Crab Bank is one of only five protected seabird nesting sites in all of South Carolina. So right now there's a move on to raise the money it takes to re-nourish and stabilize Crab Bank Island. It has a multitude of benefits, not just for the birds, but also as a barrier between storm surge and the old village of Mount Pleasant. It's also a safe passage for the shrimp boats as they come and go in and out of Shim Creek. The funding for this project is more than an individual has to donate, right? So we can't do it by ourselves, but together we can do it. So we have a once in a lifetime opportunity to bring sand from the Charleston Harbor Deepening Project and bring it right next door to Crab Bank Seabird Sanctuary to restore it back to its former glory. We are asking for $5, $10, $25, $250,000 we'll take um, to make this project happen, um, but we need you to pull out your checkbooks and help us out. I've reached into my pocket to donate to this cause and I'm asking you to do the same thing. Tell your neighbors, tell your friends, let's bring our community together and save Crab Bank.